All right, everybody. This is the Kennedy Auto three-phase variable frequency drive modification. It's an old drill press from the 19, I'm guessing 1920s, 1930s, right after line shafting. So it came with a single-phase repulse induction motor. It had only forward and only one speed. Now she stands over six feet tall and I'll just give you a little idea of what I did. I like this old drill press. It's got a lot of meat. I figured it could drew some nice holes. I needed something bigger than what I had and I have a bit of a soft spot for old machinery. So I'll show you the variable frequency and then I'll give you a little bit of a walk around and we'll just see how it goes. I use 220 single phase power so I can steal 110 off of it as well so I can run a coolant pump or a light. It takes a little bit. It's a, a Hu Yang or one of the cheap Chinese inverters and so far I'm very happy with it. it takes a minute for it to warm up. This is not connected, it's run strictly as a display. I run this for jogging, forward reverse, this is regular forward reverse, emergency stop, main power, and I have it set up so you can run a foot pedal to control the on off as well. It's got a eight speed variable speed shiv and a two-speed gearbox in the head and as you can see you can slow it down really well for tapping holes with forward and reverse which is handy and if you go to the higher speed and I still have eight faster speeds on the shoes I can use. You have a long throw on her, which works really well. Here's your engagement with the worm drive, which I'll show you in a second. You get your four feed speeds. Engagement. It automatically kicks off when this hits down here. She will kick off the drive. And I will give you a little walk around. And I'll just show you quickly inside of here. Takes a minute for her to power down. Pretty straightforward. It wasn't too bad to program. It's not the most intuitive instructions, but they work all right. These old machines are just fantastic. And at three horsepower, she's got lots of power. The variable frequency drive I'm happy with, it really keeps its torque even down to five hertz. She's got uh, all the torque you could work. I'll just take you for a little walk around so you can see it.
Now other than a few broken handles, it was in pretty good shape and I just converted to three phase and did a few upgrades. Nice big table. Beautiful old unit with enough upgrades that it is literally as good as new. All right, thanks guys. And what I'll say about the Hu Yang inverter, well worth the money. And if you run a few external switches, not a bad unit. All right, thanks guys. Hope you enjoyed.